Hey friends, it's Nate Wood at Stallman Guitars. I want to just talk to you a little bit about this Cordoba that I just finished up. And uh, it's not, not so much a matter of talking about this guitar as it is talking about the mindset of uh, how I go about repair and how different types of luthiers might go about repair and the type of luthier you might want. Uh, this guitar, it's the Coco guitar right and this guitar because it's not extremely valuable or or maybe even it's not hip enough for some people um would would get you kind of a little bit of you know attitude at a guitar shop maybe um but having having been uh, a non luthier myself having been someone who actually just really liked guitars and really wanted to create some music really wanted to write songs with my friends or go out and play um i i can relate to just wanting to make your guitar that you already like even more fun than it already is and to me that's something that i try to keep in mind constantly at my bench and while I'm engaging with people. And this is a really good example of, of that sort of thing. This is how I deal with it. Uh, I had this customer ask if I was okay with putting on a bone nut and a bone saddle and some new tuners. Like this thing got wave release, you know, like, like that's a, uh, that's just something that not everyone would choose to do, and I'm totally fine with that. Um, I am totally down to put whatever you want on there within reason. Um, I had my friend Taylor and I in one of our Instagram lives talked about not putting a Floyd on the 60s strap, for example. I probably wouldn't want to do that, but it's your guitar, it's your decision. I personally am going to have just as much fun either way. I can have fun on any instrument, as I'm sure you can too. But it helps if you relate to that instrument. If you've already had good experiences with that instrument, let's just make that one good, right? So, this here Coco guitar came in with some pretty, you know, subpar components. Sorry about that blowout there in the lighting, but it got a new bone nut, got a new bone saddle. Um, and wave release and I'm I'm into it so there there will be people out there that will be excited about your project there will be people that won't be and that's totally fine everyone's totally entitled to to like things or dislike things just as you and I are so if you if you're needing to find someone that's excited about working on your project, you can find that person. And it might not even be me. You know, it might be any other person. Um, there are things that I'm not super excited about, like finish work. I just pass that on whenever I can. I just don't like to do it. Um, or like extremely complex wiring. Not really my thing. But those people are out there and you can find them you can always find the person that you will get along with to work on your guitar they're out there i promise no matter the size of the town and if if your town somehow is too small or whatever to not have that individual you should become that individual because there is a hole that needs to be filled but uh so here's some subpar nate wood guitar playing on this thing huh
good guitar. It's going to be a fun guitar. It already is. I really wish I could show you what that nut looks like without having it be completely blown out by the lighting there. But I'll, I'll post some, some images of this to my Instagram because there's some cool uh, color variants in this piece of bone that I made the nut out of that I really like. Um, and you know, this isn't even the first Coco guitar that I have done work like this on. That's, that's my favorite part. This is, uh, this is number two. So I guess all I'm trying to say to anyone who needs to hear it is don't be afraid to go talk to a luthier. If someone treats you weird, that's just not the person you should work with. Um, you, you can find the person that you should work with. And they're out there. So I hope you're all having an excellent day. It's a good day to have an excellent day, right? Go play some guitar. I'll see you soon.